Hi, I'm Dr. Mary Frosch, and today I want to talk to you a little bit about uncomfortable comfort. When you're in a relationship and it feels like this doesn't feel right, but it's not that bad, I call that uncomfortable comfort. And what it means is that it's triggering something from your family dynamic that you grew up with. So maybe in your house, you walked on eggshells around someone in your family. We knew that as kids or even as teenagers that somebody else's emotions needed our help and we needed to support them or we wanted to avoid certain consequences or behaviors by tiptoeing around them. So if we find ourselves in a friendship or relationship with someone who we find ourselves doing this with, we know it's not great, but we kind of know it, right? It's, we, we've experienced it before and so it's comfortable even though it's not comfortable, uncomfortable comfort. When we recognize these patterns, we need to think to ourselves, what am I mimicking in my, from my childhood and what do I still need to sort through from those early relationships that shaped my life? When we can figure it out, when we can look at what those early memories are and what those pieces of our life were that we haven't quite healed from, we can stop experiencing the uncomfortable comfort patterns. We'll always have discomfort in our life as part of life. Right? But when we succumb to those early patterns because we haven't quite healed from them, we need to go back. Go back home, fix those early emotions, fix those triggers so that we can just be comfortable in our comfort. I'm Dr. Mary Frosch and this is one way to recognize things that will help you improve your connection with others and yourself. Take care. Come back and see me.